And now, Bookmarks, writers on books they love. Hello, my name's Helen MacDonald. I'm the author of H is for Hawk, and I want to recommend um, a 1973 children's book called The Darkest Rising by the author Susan Cooper. This funny thing happens in England every year. A whole bunch of friends of mine on the winter solstice, we all read this book. It's a book about magic. You know, anyone who's read uh, Harry Potter will, will know that there is a long history of books about small boys when they're about 10 or 11, realizing that they're not normal, that they have magical powers. And this is one of the early books in that kind of tradition. And it's about a, a small boy called Will, who wakes up on his 11th birthday to discover that he is in fact one of the old ones. And his job is to protect the world against the forces of darkness. This all sounds very, very cliched, but my goodness, I cannot recommend this book more highly. It's one of the most beautifully written fantasy books I've ever come across. It made the English landscape sing for me as a child. It's full of snowy woods, it's full of Arthurian legend, it's full of Anglo-Saxon myths, it's full of everyday life. There are the most astonishing sequences which brim with eerie power of, you know, the small boy who has the power to light fires out of dead wood he sees lying on paths, and the panic as he realises that for some reason he cannot put them out. You know, when you're small you, you, you're you prey to fears, you're prey to uh, panics in a way that I think disappear as you get older. And whenever I read this book, those old kind of panics about our place in the world and the limits of our powers come back bright as ever. And it's also a very poignant book. There are characters in here who suffer, there are characters who are caught out of time, and the whole thing is also about how we see the past in the landscape. And this has been very influential for me. You know, when you look at the landscape, wherever you are in the world, it's very fascinating to try and imagine who stood there before you. And this book plays with that sense and plays with the stories we've told about the places we live. And also it's got kind of really cool things that you find in fantasy books. You know, Will has to collect a series of very important things of power. Again, very Potter-like. And uh, the whole book itself is part of a, a much wider series that deals with this great fight between the dark and the light. You know, you can't mess around with that, you know, as a topic. So I really recommend you go out and buy this book. And I really hope you'll love it as much as I do. Helen MacDonald recommends The Dark is Rising by Susan Cooper. You'll find more bookmarks and an interview with MacDonald on our website at dtbook.org.